Ends. You have to replant the forest. Alright, we'll try to get a few more later. Alright, we need to head back real quick. Come on. Come on, Chester. Let's get back. So, right here. Here we are. Okay. Um, put some... We'll put a log on that fire. Um, we need to make a science machine. So, we're going to go ahead and make a science machine. We're going to put it right down here. And then I think we got enough to make an alchemy machine when I refine. I'm gonna refine some rope and boards. Uh, I got nowhere to put them, whatever. Go ahead and store those seeds in there. Um, and then some cut stone. We're gonna put the potato head thing in there. So let's see, alchemy machine needs uh, more boards actually, which I completely forgot about. So we need three more boards, which we can't actually make. We need more logs to make more boards. Chester, do you have any logs in there? No? I don't know what niter is made for. Whatever it is, I don't use it. Can't carry any more stuff. Well, pick that back up and eat it, Wilson. Don't be a baby. Okay, so, Chester, you're doing alright, aren't you? Yeah. Chester's doing pretty good. We'll just leave his torch over here. Now, we need to go out and uh, we're going to dig some more stone, first off. And then after I run out of pickaxe, I'm going to build an axe. And then we're going we're gonna to go... Um, we're gonna go get some wood. We need more wood. We need more boards to make an alchemy machine so we can jump right on in. Uh, Cause that's fairly important. Let's see if we can find some gold rocks instead of just regular rocks. Cause you might as well collect and have the gold nearby. No reason not to. Uh, well, There's some stuff down there. Some sort of monster thing. Uh, I don't know what that is. Some trees, pillars. Some sort of horse thing. Another horse thing. I'm not quite sure about that. I'm gonna stay away from that. That looks that looks like it could be a fairly dangerous place. I don't want to mess with that, personally. There's some evil flowers surrounding it as well, meaning that it's probably not a good thing to piss off those specific monsters. Ha! I got some butterfly wings. Like a boss. I think I can go ahead and let flowers rot, which may be a better alternative than letting, like, uh, you know, say, for instance, letting... <clears throat> letting my carrots rot. I'd, I'd rather avoid that if at all possible. So, going uh, too much... Going further down too much is going to be dangerous. An old... That one-eyed bird. The tall bird, I think is what it's called. I don't want to mess with them. I am not... I'm not yet prepared... Uh, oh, I got some extra. Well, I don't, I don't need that. I'm about to make an axe. Boom, got an axe. So now I can pick up all the, the flint and stones. And I still have an extra flint. Well, I thought that was going to take more flint. Uh, oof. We are very quickly running out of room. Chester, I think you got space in there for... Yeah. Space in there for those. We need to build a chest very soon. We're going to need a chest to put some stuff in. Those are made just straight up out of logs. Which you uh, refine into boards. Gonna go ahead and equip that. 
boom, and boom. So there we go. Just, just eat it, Wilson. Don't be a baby. Attack the butterfly. You can't. So we're just gonna dig up the bush. Ah, it looks like it looks like there are spiders. Can I take them? Yeah, it's, it's a small one. I can definitely take that one. Come on now. All right, keep going. If I keep backing off, then I can take them. Spiders get scared pretty easily. Just have some, have some web. Have some more web. And we'll head over here and we'll mess this thing up. Yeah! We get a couple more webs. Maybe three if we're lucky. Nope, just two. Chester, get over here, Chester. There you go. Alright. A few more seeds. Put those in old chesty. Uh, ooh, another berry bush. Oh, accidentally grabbed a tuft of grass, which I don't really have room for. We'll just carry it back. We'll just carry it back like a boss. Now, I got quite a few rabbit holes over here. I can hear that horse thing. Because it makes that kind of musical note thingy like it's an accordion even though it's a it's a horse monster so you know just let it do what it want to do man i ain't gonna say nothing i'm not gonna i'm not gonna criticize a horse monster i think i should have cut down more trees there's a disturbing lack of wood in my arsenal but i found some stuff and i went with it Come on, put, put, the, put the fuel in there, Wilson. Quit being a baby. Get over here and cut down these trees. Be a man about things, Wilson. And uh, old chesty chest over there is um, slightly retarded. Seems to be stuck. That's just, that's great news. That's great news. You know, if there's one thing that I always wanted, it was a retarded treasure chest with legs. Come here, you stupid. Well, there is absolutely nowhere to store these. Uh, so we're just going to go ahead and plant this one since it's right there. Okay. Well, that one just kind of bounced off. Like, that's just, that's just how it does things. So, you know, cool. I can't complain too much as long as it gets planted. Um, we're doing fine. I'm gonna go back over here. I'm gonna put some, uh, another tuft on the fire. <clears throat> going to, uh, we're gonna make some more boards. And I think we have enough to make an alchemy, uh, alchemy engine. So there's an alchemy engine. Bam. Blammo. Whatever you would prefer. I can make two boards now. I need two more pieces of wood. Fortunately, there is a tree right here. Well within range. And uh, I'm going to go ahead and take it. Come here, tree. I'm going to pick up all your woods. Pick up these logs here. And uh, we'll equip the shovel real quick. And bada boom. So now we can go ahead and make another log. Now I have to stand next to the science machine to produce structures, treasure chest. We'll go ahead and build a treasure chest. You need to go ahead and build your treasure chest near the fire, I found. Because at night, if it gets too dark and you're in your treasure chest, you will suddenly find yourself being attacked by that demon thing. And uh, that's just no good for anyone. I mean, you know, unless you like painful deaths, in which case, I guess it's okay. 
me. It's, it's whatever you prefer. Personally, I don't like painful deaths, so I, I tend to avoid them as much as physically possible. Um, we're gonna go ahead, we're gonna try to empty Chester as best as we can. I don't even think I need Niter. I'm just gonna throw this over here. I don't care. I don't care about it. Chester, come on, boy. Get up here. Chester's like having a mobile backpack, which is just fantastic. So, um, the silk. Uh, an extra flint. That's not really that big a deal. Charcoal will keep with us. Uh, butterfly wings put in there. I need my eye bone. We don't need this big, this metal potato head thing. We don't need these gold nuggets to stay with us. Because if we need to go back and dig for rocks, we will. Uh, as for petals, we'll just keep those there. Um, I think we need some seeds. Chester, provide me with some seeds, buddy. And uh, we'll go ahead and plant these. Plant. Plant. And plant. And boom. Now we're doing well. And I didn't plant those like I intended to. So there we go. I'm going to go ahead and plant some bushes. Plant some more bushes. We need to wait for stuff, like I said before. We need to wait for some stuff to rot. Come on. Oh, I thought I'd make it. I bet it needs one more hit. I'll put the bet down. Oh. Two more hits. Man, that was close. We'll get extra. We'll get extra log here. You don't need to worry about digging up these saplings and moving them. This sapling, however, I will dig that up. Right now we're working, we're working on a base camp. We're working on making it uh, as efficient as possible. For a good base camp, you need to not have to go far to get the supplies that are necessary for your survival. For this instance, you need sticks. You need sticks for tools and multiple other things, so you need to, you need to bring some saplings along. That way, when it is time, uh, when all the saplings are done and they're ready, you can go ahead and be like, all right, picking saplings, getting sticks, making tools. It's a good thing. It's a great thing. Same thing with berry bushes. I wish you could put berry bushes. I wish you could make, like, jam, like preserves that last longer. And uh, we're more useful. I don't know what's up with bees. I'm not, I'm not quite sure what I'm supposed to do with bees, if anything. You know, just, let's go ahead and move these as well. Um, they are close by, but I just, I don't know. I would prefer to move them, just personally. Now, we're gonna, we're gonna finish this, we're gonna finish this line of forest. Once we have finished this line of forest, we're not gonna worry so much about pine cones. Alright, I need, I need one more pine cone, really, to finish this line of forest. However, this tree's bothering me because he's just out of line. Look at him. He's like a, he's like a little tree rebel. I don't need no tree rebels up in my garden. Okay, I need trees that know what they're doing and are well aware of the consequences of their actions. And those trees are not... So let's re-equip the axe. All we need, what, what do we need? Two pine cones? How far away are we? There's some trees right down here. They should be. Also some tufts of grass. We'll go ahead and grab these. I'm going to need a new shovel soon. Uh, very soon, actually. I think this shovel has like one use left on it, really. Oh, God! That is a tree monster. Okay, I'm not fighting that. Uh, that's pretty unlucky. I heard that you have like a 1% chance to summon him, and I did. No, I'm not fighting you. I'm leaving. Goodbye. I don't know if he follows you or something. I don't know what he does. But I'm not sticking around to find out, to be perfectly honest. He seems dangerous. And I just don't want to mess with it, so. <clears throat> Let's take these pine cones. 
We'll plant a tree right there. Boom, in order like it's supposed to be. Hey, if you like that content, why don't you do me a super huge favor and click that like button. And if you like all of my content and want to see more, why don't you hit that subscribe button so you can be updated anytime I do anything new. And well, if you want to be my best friend, you can go ahead and try to share this on Facebook or Twitter or Reddit. Anywhere, really. Get that stuff out there and help this channel grow. It'd really mean a lot to me.